Whether you are new to the city or have lived here for years, there is one thing that has proved to be difficult over the years, finding a family doctor. With a potential population and economic boom looming, and many physicians retiring or working part-time, the problem doesn't appear to have an easy solution. For those new to Prince George, the city has a reputation for being a difficult place to find a family doctor. But finding a family physician is said to be getting easier. Last uh, few years we've had uh, uh, better success in uh, attracting and keeping uh, you know, young physicians in, the, in uh, our community. There are a total of 81 family medicine practitioners in town. Though some doctors work part-time and don't carry a full patient load. Only a few doctors are taking new patients off the street. Most doctors will only take patients by a referral. The Immigrant and Multicultural Services Society works with families new to the community. Uh, previously in the last year, if I think back, uh, it was quite a serious problem. You know, we had some issues where it was, uh, it was very hard to, you know, the, the list that we were given by the, uh, by the hospital uh, to find a family doctor, you know, whenever we would phone them, they, you know, they would always, always refuse. But Sharon Panu has found finding a physician for clients is getting easier this year. She has also found with the increasing Chinese-speaking population in town, it's hard to find a physician to service them. We have only one Chinese doctor in, in Prince George. And, uh, and the, the issue that we're probably facing right now is, you know, the, the, with the language barrier. Families with the language barrier, they're the ones having problem finding a Chinese doctor who can speak their language. Out of 81 family doctors in town, 27 have been fully trained in Prince George through the Northern Medical Program. Utilizing the graduates from the program to help with doctor numbers is said to be one of the strategies to having more doctors in town. Right now, Prince George is short of physicians. We know for sure that uh, there's approximately 8 to 10 physicians that were short here in the community. But many doctors in town are nearing the end of their careers. Dr. Knoll said he is likely to retire over the next five years and isn't sure if there are enough new physicians to fill in for those retiring. Zamir Karim, CKPG News.